What's going on guys, it's Eagleman here and today I have a Com C order that has finally arrived back home. I'm going to be opening up for you guys and show you some PC cards that I've been looking at lately. So let's dive into it and see what we got. There's not a lot of cards to be diving into today. Um, but the cards you'll be seeing, they're pretty cool and I am super, super excited to see them. So let's start with uh, pack number one here. And if you guys have been following the channel at all, you know I'm a huge Cleveland Indians slash Bob Feller collector here. So you can see right on top some cool stuff, right? Oh, man. Alrighty, let's dive into it. See what we got here. Bob Feller game used bat? Oh, no, no, not a game used bat. Game used patch there. Check that out. That's so cool. That's a sweet looking card as well. Got the, uh, the receipt on the back there. Uh, Gypsy Queen gold border. There's a, an upper deck Gaudi card. That's pretty cool. We got a Gypsy Queen white border. Is that the same as the gold? Same set? No, it's not. Different set. Um, building on my rainbow for the stadium club. That's the red foil base. So that one's really neat. We have Bowman Heritage. This is such a weird card to me. It's like a mini card, but it's, it's a part of the municipal stadium seat. So kind of unique. Um, really cool though that's a reprint of his rookie card by the way so that one's really really cool uh, let's see here another bob feller base um this is from 2021 opening day of course he's the only pitcher to ever throw in a no hitter on opening day that's one of his claim to fame so that's a really cool really cool one there another part of the rainbow here so here's just the base chrome refractor gotta check i'm i got a lot going on for that rainbow uh, this is a really unique card. St. Vincent and the Grenadines Baseball Hall of Fame Heroes. Really just a unique card there from 1992. And then just a base franchise fees. This card was probably the cheapest out of all of them. Only a couple pennies here and there. So that's the first bag. Some really cool stuff there. Let's take out the relics. Uh, this one isn't really a relic of Bob Feller. It's just of Municipal Stadium. We'll dive into the second bag here. This will be a relatively short video, keeping it quick. But I just love showing these Com C orders because I get really excited looking at these uh, these PC items for myself. They're just super cool to me. So here we go. Okay. Oh yes, there's a sweet card at the very end here. So stay tuned. That's ooh, great card. So got a uh, patch here, a 325. It's pretty cool. Another relic. Um, this is wow. What a gorgeous looking card. It's from National Tre Treasures. This is numbered out of 99. 2015. What a gorgeous looking card. What a cool patch too. That's sweet. I love getting patches of, of older players. It's obviously, especially a Bob Feller. That was a base gallery. Here's a Topps Tribute base card. Uh, great shine too. That's from 2016. Yeah, so I have a lot of this rainbow. Nearly complete now. I have the red out of five. I can't remember. The green, the gold, and now the base. So... A lot is getting done on that 2016 tribute. Here's another Triple Threads card from 2012. Uh, Chasing History. This is the hollow foil one. And this is the one that I was super, super happy to have found. Check this one out. Man, this is so cool. This is like not even just a Bob Feller card. This is just an insane card. <laughs> Look at this. This is from Fleer Flare. Boom. <laughs> That's so cool. Check it out. So we got Bob Feller, Larry Doby. Uh, Victor Martinez, Travis Hafner, and CC Sabathia. So this was made in, let me check the year on this, 2005. So you guys got the old and the new. Larry Doby, Bob Feller, some of the, the greatest Cleveland Indians to ever play. And of course you got Victor Martinez, Travis Hafner, CC Sabathia, kind of the new uh, relative to the time. But there's only a, there's a uh, Victor Martinez patch there. And that's a sweet looking patch. Like check that patch out. That's, a, that's really, really good looking. One, two, three, four. I see four different colors on that patch. And, and a nice angle on it so that's an amazing amazing looking card um the reason i bought it was for bob feller but obviously being a huge cleveland indians fan this is just so cool so this is actually my first booklet in my collection so really really cool it's never out of 99 by the way uh, a little beat up but i don't really care i mean condition's not like super important to me i know it is to some people but to me i just i just don't care that much about condition man it's it's i buy the card and i just don't really care too much about condition. So there's the booklet we we're just looking at. Don't want to damage it too much though. Uh, there's the uh, the tribute there. That's a sweet one too. That relic, really like that one a lot, as well as this relic, and the municipal stadium relic. That one's also really neat. There's another one. This one's a really cool patch. You can I don't know if the camera will pick this up, 
but it's got like a, a really deep indented texture to it. There's like almost like a pinstripe or a seam on the side there, so really cool patch. Uh, just a couple of another base cards. We're using this to complete the rainbow. And I'm including the rainbow to be the base and the chrome for the stadium club, so cool stuff there. So just a lot of base cards I'll be using to, to finish up my Bob Feller PC. If you haven't seen that video where I detailed out how I PC my Bob Feller cards, I'd love for you to check it out. It's basically a massive Excel spreadsheet where I wrote a Python program that automatically extracted and compiled every Bob Feller card ever made in the history of the universe. And it, it, I use it to, to gauge what cards I need, what cards I already have, how much I spent on it. So it's a really good organizational way I used to to collect my PC. So if you're interested in checking that out, I would highly recommend it. But other than that, thank you all so much for joining me in today's little Comp C order. I was super happy, especially for this awesome, awesome booklet. So thank you so much for sticking around. Really appreciate it, guys. If you enjoyed it, please like and subscribe for more of these videos to come. And I will see you guys next time.